Okay, you have just finished learning that OA can go O, 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 like an opal orangutan. And we have already learned that O consonant E can go O, O, O also, because the E is going to sprinkle its magic on the O or boss the O around to say its name. Now, we also know that O by itself is Ali Octopus, ah, ah, ah. So today we're going to practice writing words and thinking in our heads. Do I hear ah, 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 or o, o, o? Now, when I hear o, 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 I'm going to have to think, does it look right? Because that's what writers ask themselves. And I'm going to need to think, does it look right to go to write it as o, a? or O consonant E. So let me give you an example. If I'm going to write the word cone, k own, I can write it like this with the E bossing the O around and making it say its name. Or we could go k own. And I can have OA making the O sound. But as a writer, I remembered that cone is going to be C O N E. So I have to think, does it look right? And I think that C O N E looks right for cone. Now I'm going to write the word top. Top. So I'm going to go t. Ah. I'm going to say it slowly, and I hear ah, ah, ah. So that means that I have to do Ali Octopus. So that short O, that's O by itself, and then the P. T, ah, top. The next word I'm going to write is t, ode, ode. So I know I hear opal orangutan. So I know that it's going to be this way or this way because these are the two ways we've learned. So let's try it and ask ourselves, does it look right? So does toad look right? T-O-A-D? Or does it look right? T-O-D-E? Because these are the two ways that we've learned that O can say its name either OA or the E bossing the O around. And I'm thinking as a writer that it looks right for toad is T-O-A-D. So that's how I'm going to write it. Let's do another example. And I have the word boat. So there's two ways so far that I could make boat. I could go b and put OA. Oat, or I could do O consonant E, B, Oat, because both of those have the Oat word pattern. But I'm thinking as a writer that B O A T looks right for boat. Let's try another word, K, A, T, Cot. Well, I don't hear opal orangutan. I hear Ali octopus, ah, ah, ah. So I know that that's going to be O by itself. K, ah, cot. Let's try another word, r, o's, rose. So I hear O, O, O opal orangutan. So I'm going to try these two ways and I'm going to ask myself, does it look right? R O's. Hmm, I don't think I've ever seen that word before. That's with O-A. Let's try O consonant E and C. R O's. Oh, this definitely looks right. I've seen this before. O's. Rose. So as a writer, I would write rose as R-O-S-E. Let's try another word. G-O-A-T. 
goat. Well, I hear O, 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 so I know it's going to be one of these two ways that we've learned so far. So let's try O, A, G, O, T, hmm, I think that looks right, but let's try O consonant E, G, O, T, hmm, I don't think I've ever seen this word before. It has the o word pattern in it, but I don't think so. I think this looks right, having oat, O-A-T, goat. So this is how I would write it. So as a writer, I'm asking myself, does it look right? Okay, let's try another one. And this word is rod, rod. And I hear ah, ah, ah. So that's gonna be Ollie octopus, okay? So that's gonna be O by itself. R Odd rod. Okay, now I'm gonna make the word r road. Road. Hmm. And actually now that I said it, road can be written two different ways. Let me show you this. I can go r ode r o a d or I can write road r o d e. These words are homophones. They sound the same but they mean two different things so it depends on how I'm saying. If I want to talk about the road that I drove on it would be r o a d or if I want to talk about the road like I rode a bike, it would be R-O-D-E. So this word actually looks right written both ways. It just depends on the meaning. And I would have to remember which road means what. Okay? So when you do your writing, I want you to ask yourself, does it look right? When you hear Ali Octopus, ah, ah, ah. That's going to be O by itself. When you hear opal orangutan, O, 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 there are at least these two ways we'll learn about more, O, A, or O consonant E. And I want you to write it and ask yourself, does it look right?